my name is Esriantera. Um, I would like to explain the material in chapter 5, namely formative assessment. The definition formative assessment. Formative assessment is the process of collecting information about students' performance for the purpose of making instructional decisions. Timely assessment helps students and teachers identify where students excel and where they need additional help. Quizzes, tests, and assignments provide assessment information as does informal teacher observation. Next, assessment tools. Assessment tools can be used for pre-assessment, monitoring progress, and post-assessment. Tools, assess, uh, tools to assess and measure, list, and measure learning. Uh, first, test. The second, quizzes. The third, worksheets. And the last, performances. On the next slide is assessment strategies to find out if students have learned the content. First, classroom games. Jeopardy, bingo, or relays where students have to run to get the right answer are a few examples. Volunteers who teach English as a foreign language might also check out grammar games which has some classic games that could be adapted for other content subject too. Uh, the second skits and performances invite groups of students to make up and perform a skit this depicting an historical event environmental concern parent and parent or your discussion etc to show their knowledge about the topic or life scale the number three journals journal can be very time consuming to read and evaluate if you do not have time to read and comment on every journal entry, ask students to put a mark on one or two entries they would like you to read and evaluate. Number four, KWL chart. Ask students to divide a piece of paper into three columns. Title the first column, what I know. The second column, what I want to know, and the third column, what I learned. On the like, uh, on the last slide is using feedback from ongoing assessment, a clear benefit to assessing to assessing student progress along the way, is to be able to catch students who have not mastered material before. Moving on to new material. That's all my explanation. Thank you for your attention. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.